This is Cody with FacebookandMarketing.com. Tonight, we're going to add a product here on our Magenta website. First, we'll start off by putting our cursor over the catalog, then over Manage Products, and then we're going to go ahead and click on Manage Products. We'll move over here to Add Product, and click this button, and that'll bring us to the initial page. Leave this where it is, and a group product means if you had a bunch of stuff you wanted to sell uh, for a beach set, sand castle toys, beach chairs, beach umbrella, it'd become a group product because they're a part of a group that you're trying to sell, so they'll upsell each other. Um, configurable product. Uh, you can look that up. Virtual product. This is something that is also downloadable. Um, maybe a subscription or a link. Um, maybe something that is not downloadable but is still digital. They call it a virtual pro or product. Um, a bundle product. Uh, it's Look back up here to group configurable. These all can be found on Google for more explanation. And uh, downloadable product like virtual product. Anyway, we're going to stick with it and be easy and click simple product. And I suggest you do the same for the time being. Hit continue. And, uh, just wait a second. Let it load up. Alright. Off the bat, the first thing we want to do so we don't lose any information is we want to name the product. And then we want to hit save and continue edit. As you'll notice, it's required to do it, so let's fill this out real quick. The weight of your item needs to go here for shipping purposes. The SKU needs to go here for invoice purposes. Uh, it needs to be set to enabled in order for the product to show up in your website. To leave uh, everything else as default. I'm going to go ahead and make it a featured product. All that means is, is it will show up when I put a particular code in on the front page. I'll make another tutorial about that. But anyway, here we'll have our meta information. This is your search engine information. This is the title that have come up in the search engine. These are the keywords that the search engine finds it by. And this is the description someone will see um, for your website and search engine if you happen to come up with the results. Uh, the image, you can upload a file for this particular product and um, you can have multiple images for the particular product. Don't worry about this, it doesn't matter. Don't worry about design. You can use a gift message if you want. All it asks is, is, um, is this a gift so we know to wrap it. The quantity, the inventory quantity. If you only have 100 units, set the quantity to 100 units. And when you run out, the website will say it's run out. This is all to figure for future reasons. And stock availability, we'll set it as in stock. You need to make sure you do that. Then we'll go to categories. We'll click that. And then we'll look through, and we don't have any other products yet, so we're not going to worry about it from this point on out. But what we'll do is we'll hit save, continue. Oh, we're going to make a price. See Magenta will hop back and give this to you. I'll show you where the errors are at. And this is how you uh, set a product up. This is Cody Krasicki, and I hope this helped out, and uh, I'll see you soon.